I think the main thing is that we take assumptions as to what our customer wants to hear. And I think it's very important that we take the time and actually ask them what they want to be told um, instead of making assumptions based on our own biases or our own knowledge of the product. Um, so I think learning how to get to the root of what the customer is asking for, what's going to help them make their decision to purchase and buy. So it's not just to pick it up, but what's actually going to communicate enough to them to make them make that purchase is probably the biggest thing I'd like them to leave with. I think the biggest change that I've seen is in the amount of packaging. We've tried desperately to reduce the amount of packaging. Um, you know, I, when you say, for example, you take and you go school shopping for your kids and you come home and there's an entire garbage bag full of plastic hangers and clips and hang tags and size wrappers and, and all of that. And I think the, the world itself is trying to be much more responsible. And it's not even just sustainability, it's responsible, right? Being responsible with what we have and what we're charged with. So I think everyone tried to reduce the amount of packaging that we have and make the packaging less harmful to the environment. But in doing that, it causes a very unique, um, you have less real estate to communicate on. If we're going to reduce the amount of packaging, you have to think very carefully about, you still want to make sure the product is protected. You still want to make sure it, it gets to the customer in a clean format. It's not dirty from the conveyor belts and all those other things that go into external packaging. But then you think the internal packaging as well, the woven labels and all of those different things that we have. Um, we just have to be much better stewards with using raw materials um, less and using more recycled and, and um, refurbished and recaptured. Um, materials from the very beginning um, because when you spend your entire career making trash <laughs> you want it to be beautiful obviously but you want it to serve a purpose and not be harmful right so I think the the biggest um, roadblocks we have are how do you take that smaller amount of packaging be more responsible with it but still communicate and protect the, the items as much as you need to it's a unique challenge You know, what I, I think is so great about these is there's very few true apparel, apparel or hard home, soft home retailers here, right? Is a lot of times it's the food industry, the drug industry, the beauty industry. And whereas, you know, a lot of people might be intimidated by that, I actually thrive on the fact that they may have a solve that I can take and apply to something in my world and vice versa. So I think it's just that open dialogue and the unique solves that other people have been able to come up with that as you talk through those and you learn through those with different people, um, it just helps you bring back better ideas and, and more, you know, things that you can pr particularly relate to your, your world and, and make things that, uh, you know, there's a lot of problems to solve. And there's times when you're just, you hit a roadblock and you're like, oh, I've tried that a million times. I've, but then just seeing one other solution that someone else brings to the table can, can click and, and bring that light bulb moment and you're like, ah, I've got it now, I've got it figured out. So I think that's the best part, just intermixing of all the different industries. I would say thought provoking because um, for pretty much the similar thing I was just speaking of, right? Just hearing how different people approach the same problems um, and how they've come up with solves or how they work together in different ways, in different processes, in different um, members of their team, different org structures. Um, I think it's, in, it's very inspiring um, and, and it just provokes a lot of internal mind speak in my brain um, to where it's very thought provoking for me.